Today on MTG Unpacked, we're getting stuck into Ravnica Clue Edition. So this is an awesome new thing here. Basically taking Clue or Cluedo and bringing it to magic. So let's get into it. We'll see what this is about. So these are going for about 54 bucks on TCG Player right now. That's US dollars. So let's see what we get for our money. Okay, so a nice box here for all the goodies. So there's all the cast of characters and a nicely organized setup in here. So let's see, we have a one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, so eight of these shuffle two packs and play. So basically like a jump start type thing. And what else do we have in here? All right, so a notepad. So when you're trying to figure out who did it with what weapon in what room, you can check that. And then we have these little privacy screen things here. So you can hide your deductions from your opponents. So we've got one, two, three, four of those. Okay. Oh, and I nearly forgot a Shockland box topper. We'll take a look at that later in the video. And then we have our confidential envelope. So this is where we put the actual suspect and the weapon and so forth. So let's take a look here. So who do we have? We have Headliner Scarlet, Cult of Rakdos, Mastermind Plum, for House Demir, Commander Mustard for the Boros Legion, Senator Peacock for the Azorius Senate. And who else do we have here? It is Emissary Green for the Celesnia Conclave, and Apothecary White for the Orzov Syndicate. Alright, so let's take a look here. So this tells you how to set everything up. And I'll let you freeze frame that, see what that's all about. I think I know how this works anyhow. Uh, what else do we have here? Oh, something in this. What is this? Okay, just some dividers. Okay. And also, oh, I see. We've got a box here. You can actually pop the dividers in. I guess they slide in like so. So uh, yeah, we'll take care of that later. And then finally, in this thing, what is this? Suspects, weapons, and rooms. Ah, all right. So we will take a look at this thing. So this is uh, basically you shuffle this up. Uh, shuffle up three sets of things, actually. And then pop them in the envelope here and then hand out the rest to the players. And then you've got to figure out who the murderer is. So we'll start off with the weapons here. We've got a wrench, candlestick, lead pipe, a knife, rope, and this looks like unique artwork for this set. We've got the ballroom, billiard room, conservatory, dining room, Hall and kitchen. They make it look like uh, the board game as well. That's cool. Library, lounge, secret passage, study. And here are the suspects. We have Apothecary White, Senator Peacock, Mastermind Plum, Headliner Scarlet, Emissary Green, and finally Commander Mustard. Okay, so we'll set those aside. So you can actually have two win conditions. The traditional way of playing Magic, where you get your opponent's life total down to zero. Or, if you correctly guess the murderer and the room and the weapon, then you win the game as well. So, an added dimension to gameplay here. So yeah, these are like the jumpstart packs. We have Selesnya Conclave. Let's see what we get in this one. So we've got a Doomed Traveller, War Screecher, Celestia Guild Mage, Seller of Songbirds, Samala Rumblers, Urbis Protector, 
God's Willing, Rootborn Defences, Martial Impetus, Conclave Tribunal, Thriving Heath, Silesnia Guildgate, Silesnia Sentry, Conclave Evangelist. Okay, so there's a rare and a mythic Trustani Discordant. And I wonder if these are all the same or if there's some randomness. I'm not sure. Alright, so planes. We've got two, three, four, five. Okay, so five lands there. Okay, so there's Silesnia Conclave. Let's see what we get in the next one. So is this something you would think of picking up? Let me know in the comments. Are you familiar with the board game Clue? Or in some parts of the world, like in Australia, I remember it was uh, Cluedo. But same basic thing. Okay, next we have the Azorius Senate. With an owl familiar, Jeering Homunculus. Cloudkin Seer, Rescuer Sphinx, Portal Manipulator. And a split card, Depose and Deploy. Followed by an Azorius Signet, Curse of Chains, Turn to Mist, Code of Constraint, Thriving Isle, Azorius Guildgate, Azorius Chancery, and the rare is Suppressor Skyguard. We also get Lavinia of the Tenth, and then we get five islands. Okay, so Azorius, Selesnya. What is next? What is your favorite guild for me? Gotta be Rakdos, you get the red and black there. And yeah, we get another Selesnya Conclave. So we will see if this matches the other one. So if we have eight packs, I wonder if we'll get uh, how many guilds? Yeah, there might be a bit of overlap here. Let's get this off of here. There we go. So Selesnya Conclave round two. So we've got Transluminant. Okay, I don't remember that one. Venati Shieldmate, Selesnya Guildmage, and Yeva's Force Mage, Samala Rumblers, Affectionate Indric, Vines of the Recluse, Selesnya Signet, Band Together, Overcome, Thriving Grove, Selesnya Guildgate, Selesnya Sentry, and Vernal Sovereign. Okay, so some nice variety here. Along with Beast Whisperer for the second rare. And of course the forests. Okay, so we've got green. I see. Okay, so we have white and green. That makes sense. So that makes up Silesnia. On to our next one here. Hopefully. Oh, here we go. Here's a different one. So we've got Gruel. So that is red and green if you're not familiar with the guilds of Ravnica. So we've got Gruul Clans followed by Grabblehide Goblin. Yes, love the Goblin Stormblood, Berserker, Pyrewild Shaman, Turret Ogre, Furious Spine Splitter, Chain Whip Cyclops, Ripscale Predator, Gruul Signet, Shiny Impetus, Fire Spout, Thriving Bluff, Gruul Guildgate and Gruul Turf. And Herald of Ilharg. And Ilharg is the boar god. I wonder if we can find one of those. We've got Clan Defiance. And then we have five mountains. Okay, so we have Gruul. What is up next? Can we get all of the guilds? Let's see what is in this next pack here. And of course, it doesn't want to open. All right, so this is a different one. <laughs> this uh, Simic Combine, that's an interesting looking beast. So we've got a Soriform Hybrid, Dust Shell Crawler, Steeple Creeper, Scuttling Sentinel, Ivy Lane Denizen, Battlefront Crew Shock, Scuttle Gator, and we have Incubation and Incongruity, followed by Snake Form. Nissa's Judgment, Thriving Grove, Simic Guildgate, Simic Growth Chamber, and Lonus Genetics Expert. A snake elf detective, that's fun. Ooh, and a mythic, the famous Hydroid Crisis. I remember when that one was in standard. I think it was Ravnica Allegiance, I'm going to say. Please correct me if I'm wrong. Okay, so we have three more packs left. Then we will get into that box topper. 
see what that is all about. Okay, so we do have a different guild here. It is, of course, the Is It League. Okay, so what do we get in this one? Fire Urchin, Frostburn Weird, Spellgorger Weird, uh, Ecstatic Electromat, so a Goblin Wizard, awesome, Goblin Wizardry, Living Lightning, Lightning Bolt, Street Spasm, Is It Signet, Direct Current, Thriving Bluff, Is It Guildgate, Is It Boilerworks, and Corporeal Projection for the rare, Hypersonic Dragon, and then we have our five mountains. Okay, on to the final two packs. So yeah, this seems like it would have way more replayability than most magic sets. And you do get sort of like a jumpstart type thing. So yeah, that's cool. Alright, so here we have an Azoria Senate. So we've seen that one before. So, see what else we get in here. We've got a Law Rune Enforcer, Azoria Seresta, War Screecher, Trusted Pegasus Portal Manipulator, Azorius Justicia, Enforcer Griffin, Oust, Curse of Chains, Rally to Battle, Thriving Heath, Azorius Guildgate, Azorius Chancery, and Lavinia Foil to Conspiracy, and Supreme Verdict. This spell can't be counted. Destroy all creatures. And then we have our planes. So final pack here. This better be Rakdos. Otherwise I am going to be very disappointed. Hope so. Keep your fingers crossed everybody. Yes. Here it is. The Cult of Rakdos. That is what we want to see. Okay, so I wonder if we'll get Rakdos himself in here. We've got the Cult of Rakdos, along with Footlight Fiend, Rakdos Trumpeter, Gurmag Swiftwing, Dagger Claw Imp, Vindictive Vampire Blade Juggler, Rakdos Signet, Deadly Dispute, along with Murder, Incriminating Impetus, Thriving More, Rakdos Guildgate, Rakdos Carnarium, and Frenzied Gore Spawn. What the heck? Okay, there's our rare. And a Mythic Spawn of Mayhem. Along with some Swamps. Okay. So there we have our eight guild packs. Let's see what we get in here. The Shockland Box Topper. Sealed product, not for resale. I'm sure that will stop everybody. Okay, so let's get into it. And it does not appear to be a pull tab. So we will have to open this, hopefully, without destroying it too badly. And, okay, so a little bit of pringling here I'm noticing. Yep. All right, what do we get? Oh, nice one. We got a temple garden. And this is new artwork for this clue edition. That is fantastic. Let's whack that in a sleeve. Alright, so now I'm curious, if you bought one of these, what did you actually get? Did you get the same selection of guilds? Did you get different mythics or rares? Let me know in the comments. And most importantly, which of these shot clans did you get? So there we have it, Ravnica Clue Edition. Looks pretty cool. Actually better than I was expecting. Hope everyone's staying safe and healthy out there. Thanks for watching and have a great day.